Let's look at final exam, question number 35 in Everyday Math Demystified, second edition. Please refer to pages 240 and 241. The question asks us, if someone tells you that a sample of water has a temperature of minus 10 degrees C, that's Celsius, on the surface of the earth, you can conclude what? And then it gives you uh, various choices as to the state in which the water uh, exists. And finally, the state of mind of the person who's talking to you, if that matters. On the Celsius scale, zero degrees represents the freezing point of water at sea level on the earth. So, if you have a sample of water and you cool it below zero degrees Celsius on the surface of the earth at standard atmospheric pressure, it's going to freeze solid. Well, we're talking about minus 10 degrees Celsius here, somewhere around uh, there. So we can be pretty sure, in fact, we can be absolutely certain if the water itself actually has a temperature of minus 10 on the Celsius scale, it is frozen solid. So the answer is B. We should note that on the surface of the earth, at sea level, at standard pressure, water will boil at 100 degrees Celsius. That's 212 degrees Fahrenheit. Freezing, 0 degrees Celsius plus 32 degrees Fahrenheit. However, if the pressure drops, for example, if you go up into the mountains and then you try to boil a kettle of water, you're going to find that it's going to boil at a slightly lower temperature. So if you intend to, for example, soft boil some eggs or hard boil some eggs, depending upon your preference, you'll find that you have to boil it for a little longer if you're up in the mountains to get the same result as you would get at sea level. Uh, rarely do we encounter situations on at sea level where the pressure varies enough to make a difference as to how long you'd have to boil an egg. I guess, just as an aside, if you decide to, that you want to soft boil an egg during the eye of a Category 5 hurricane, you're probably going to have to boil it a little longer than you would uh, under normal circumstances. So the next time you happen to be so fortunate as to find yourself in the eye of a Category 5 hurricane, where the barometric pressure is only about nine-tenths of normal, <laughs> you can try that experiment and see what happens. <clears throat> I have been in the eye of a Category 5 hurricane, though, and I can assure you that the last thing on my mind was soft boiling eggs. Once again, though, to get back to the point of this question, if you have a sample of water that's at minus 10 degrees Celsius at the surface of the earth under normal pressure, it's going to be frozen solid. The answer is B.